Aspinder, the Pokemon Game Freak designed specifically to drive completion, it's completely insane. The pattern of its spots is randomized by its personality value, and depending on how you calculate it, there might be as many as 3.9 billion possible variations of this Pokemon, so good luck catching them all, I guess. Beyond that, it's a very simple, plushy style Pokemon, an adorable, soft little critter with some cartoon stylization to make it as appealing as possible. The gimmick, beyond the randomized spots, is that it's dizzy for whatever reason. Maybe it's spun around in a circle too many times, like you sometimes do when you're a kid. And so it's always stumbling and tottering over like a cute cartoon mascot does when they're dizzy. And that's kind of it. Like, there's really not a lot to this thing. Either you're charmed and you think it's cute, or else it's wobbly, swirly-eyed gimmick gets old and you really get nothing out of it. And for me, I am more in the latter half. Frankly, Spinda doesn't really do anything for me, and beyond its silly gimmicks, it doesn't really have anything to recommend it.